Hemodialysis versus peritoneal dialysis. Here are the key differences that you need to know. Hemodialysis takes place outside of the body. Blood is pumped into an artificial kidney called a dialyzer, and solutes from the blood diffuse into a fluid called dialysate. This can take place in hospital or at home, typically for four hours, three times a week. For hemodialysis, patients need an arteriovenous fistula or a tunneled central venous catheter. A fistula is preferred, but it takes six to eight weeks to become usable, whereas a CVC gives immediate access, but it does carry a higher risk of infection. Often patients use a CVC in the meantime, whilst an AV fistula is being created. Peritoneal dialysis takes place inside the body. Dialysate fluid is infused into the peritoneal cavity through a catheter and remains there for a few hours. Solutes and fluids from the peritoneal vessels diffuse across the peritoneal membrane into the dialysate and are removed. The two types of peritoneal dialysis include continuous ambulatory peritoneal dialysis, which involves manual exchanges four times a day, or automated dialysis, where a machine handles the exchanges overnight.